Yeah, we've uh, received information that there was uh, active meth lab cooking going on at a residence at 2406 Windswept Way. And based on information from uh, re reliable information, we executed a search warrant at this residence and determined there were approximately six one pot uh, meth labs located at the house. Uh, we're in the process now of uh, waiting for the State Bureau of Investigation to show up to do the final cleanup and evaluation of the residence. Now can you explain what the one pot method is? Uh, most uh, individuals who do this method of cooking use a two liter bottle. It's called the shake and bake method. It's uh, very volatile. It can possibly cause explosions and uh, it's basically a more simple way of uh, cooking methamphetamine and uh, usually in smaller quantities uh, up to uh, multiple grams to ounce quantities. Now, have, have you all seized any items from this house? We're waiting for the State Bureau of Investigation to arrive to do that, but we will be taking uh, certain uh, materials that we've located uh, uh, in, at the residence. Uh, and what will happen to this house after it's cleaned up? There'll be an evaluation done. Uh, it'll be posted for a period of time, and uh, once it's safe to re-inhabit, uh, it'll be allowed to be done. And can you tell me if the people who inhabit this house have been arrested? Uh, they've yet to be arrested. Uh, we're still attempting to locate uh, one individual that we know for certain uh, will be charged. And did you say the people were living in this house? Yes. And were there any children in this house, if you can say? Not that we're aware of at this point. How many people live here? Two that we're aware of, yes. Anything else? Um, How much methamphetamine were they making? Uh, that would be still under investigation. Is it a significant amount, a small amount? It could be a significant amount depending on uh, what process and how often they cook. And how did these guys come to your attention? Uh, through uh, information we received through sources that we have, that they were actively cooking meth at this residence. Do you know how long they were working here? Uh, we have had information on and off about uh, the prime suspect here for probably a year. And uh, we followed up the information to allow us to uh, uh, come up with probable cause to search the residence. And there is some finished product inside the house. Will there be any more, uh, what will be the longer term outcome of, of this seizure today? Uh, we're hopeful of uh, developing additional information that may lead us in other places. Locally? Hopefully. Or regionally or national? How well, that, you just don't know until you uh, follow the leads wherever they take. You know, a lot of times, the smaller investigations lead to other places and uh, you just follow those leads to wherever they conclude.